Uh, they did it. Adidas finally is no longer partnering with Yeezys. Uh, quote, Foot Locker Inc. does not tolerate any form of anti-Semitism or hateful and discriminatory behavior. We will, while we remain a partner and carry a wide assortment of their collections, we will not be supporting any further Yeezys product, a Foot Locker spokesperson saw, uh, said. So they were um, getting a bad, like, places were not uh, wanting to work with them. As you can see here, their stock, uh, simply because of that. I mean, it looks like their stock has been going down for the past year, which, like, damn, Adidas. But, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's kind of crazy, but it, it, it's, it's a great publicity, great publicity for them. But what it is also is similar to Corey X Kenshin. If you didn't know about that, and I don't know how you didn't know about that, but I'm not here to judge. Essentially, Corey um, had made a video basically exposing YouTube for like, hey, my video got taken uh, and put on age-restricted, but Markiplier's video with the exact same content in it did not. And they're like, hmm, that's weird, we'll check into it. And then they decided that it was not a mistake and that uh, in, instead, so people got mad and then they had demonetized Markiplier's video showing that they're only doing that because it looks better and because um, it's not actually changing anything. Instead of uh, what they should have done is as soon as they saw that what Ye had said, uh, they needed to just cut ties with him. I'm not here to hate on him or anything. Uh, I believe that what he said is gross, but I also, it seems as if he is not uh, mentally uh, all there, and he should get helped for that. Um, yeah. I, um, it's just for Adidas to look better, and it doesn't actually help anything. Uh, yeah. So that's it. I just wanted to say that, and I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.